Black Screen Max are coming at you with, well, last time I came at you, it was for unboxing, so I guess I thought, might as well give you another one. Now, I know what's in here, but do you? I don't think so. And by the size of this, you might have an idea. You might have the idea of, of what could be in here. Now, there's only one figure in here, so let's give you a little, uh, little five second thinking time, alright? Have you thought of it yet? Alright, well, we're gonna get to this in a second. What's in here is something that I've been eating, something that I've been dying for for like... It's been quite a bit. Now, I'm looking at the Autobot display that this is gonna be going in, and there's a hole there, and this figure is going to finally, finally allow me to fill that hole. So, without further ado, um, I'd use the box cutter, you know, my handy dandy safety box cutter, Lowe's issued, but we're not going to get into that. I would use that, but I don't think I need to use that right now. Why? The type of box it is. There's no tape. It's like, come on, man, you know. Anyway, let's get to this figure. Let's get to this unboxing. Let's get to seeing what's in the box and what kind of packaging material we used. Yeah, that's one of my favorite parts of opening up these boxes. You never know if you're going to get a bunch of uh, packing peanuts. You don't know if you're going to get bubble wrap. Those little air packs that like they, that come with like shipping nowadays. Um, newspapers. Or my personal favorite that this is my old time personal favorite. It was a box that I got, I think, man, I don't remember what figure it was, but still, moving on. Um, it, this was my most all time personal favorite for packing material. The person that I purchased the figure off of, actually, I actually got it from, uh, I believe it might have been the TFW boards or the AllSpark forums, but I open the box, I see a whole bunch of shredded paper, so I start looking at it because, you know, you get curious as far as what people use for their packing material. So I look at it and it was a whole entire shredded up Game Informer magazine. Now I gotta say that was quite unique. This person used a whole entire Game Informer, shredded it up, put it in a box, taped it up, wrote my name on it, sent it over here to my house. That was awesome. Um, yeah, so guys, if you have any Game Informer magazines, that's a great way to recycle them. And you never know, you might get somebody that uh, that likes to do puzzles and might try to put it together. No, I have not done that. But anyway, let's move on to this unboxing before this turns into a vlog. So, grabbing the box again. Uh, we got the little flaps at the side. We're just gonna rip this off. Let's take that open. And, what is it with people sending me stuff nowadays with bits of newspaper from shopping centers from like supermarkets apparently this is a supermarket named Sobeys so awesome apparently Sobeys is having a uh, sale on Canada Dry and Coca-Cola 12 packs for $2.99 each so guys if you're in the area of a Sobeys uh, get a wallet top $2.99 each you, you can't go wrong with that. 12 pack. Come on. It's 75 cents in the vending machine for a can of Coke. So, yeah. Alright, taking that out. Taking this out. Uh, I hate people that pack things really, really good, but I love them. And we're... Eh, yeah, we're empty. We're double packed. So. Oh, oh, oh. Alright. Now this is a bag from 
what appears to be a guy I don't know. Maybe this, maybe the maybe the Sobies that they got that from. Who knows? But it's a green bag, and it's actually a green bag. It was made from recycled products. Taking this bag off. <laughs> okay, I'm a little excited. We have Transformers Prime first edition cliff jumper. Uh, I've been waiting to get this my hands on this guy for a while. I can finally fill up the hole. I'm done with buying my first edition figures for Transformers Prime. I've got Optimus, Bumblebee, RC, Bulkhead, Starscream, first edition Viacon. I'm finally done. Now I can move on to getting the Arms Micron figures like Arms Micron Breakdown, Arms Micron Unicron. Um. Yeah! <laughs> but anyway, guys, we got Cliff Jumper here. You'll see him later on in the review line, so just letting you know. Yeah. I'll let you know whether I recommend this guy or not. And, but you know what? I have seen uh, I have seen videos and everything and images of this guy, and I have a feeling I'm not going to be disappointed when I open this guy up. So, guys, I'll be back at you with a whole bunch more. You guys have a good day.